Did you know every third person above age of 60 years suffers from age related hearing loss or senile deafness or what we call as presbycusis. Hi, in this video I am going to talk about age related hearing loss or senile deafness. My name is Dr. Rajar Doifode. I am a consultant ear nose throat surgeon practicing in Mumbai. If you have to ask people to repeat themselves quite often, if you have trouble listening to TV or radio and have to put the volume higher, you have difficulty when more than two people are speaking or if you have difficulty in hearing in crowded places and often hear people mumbling, then probably you are suffering from age-related senile deafness. And there is a simple five-minute test called as audiometry to confirm whether you are suffering from hearing loss or not. As we age, the hearing nerves undergo degeneration and we suffer from age-related hearing loss. This is a physiological problem that happens like as we age, our eyes develop cataracts which is opacification of the lens. Unfortunately, age-related hearing loss is permanent and irreversible and we don't have medical or surgical treatment to reverse it and the only options available are digital hearing aids which help us to hear conversational voices and filter out unwanted sounds. Persons with untreated hearing loss reduce their social interaction for fear of being ridiculed and embarrassed in social environment. They experience loneliness, depression and start withdrawing from social life, pushing them towards greater risk of dementia. Individuals with hearing loss have five times more risk of developing dementia. The brain is stimulated by interacting with other people as we hear and listen them. The less we interact with other people, the less we hear with our brain, putting our brain activities to decline and pushing us more towards the risk of Alzheimer's. There is 24 times higher risk in individuals having hearing loss to develop Alzheimer's disease. Severe the hearing loss, even higher the risk. Recent studies have shown that patients who wear hearing aids maintain better brain function and are less likely to progress to Alzheimer's and dementia than those not wearing hearing aids. As I mentioned earlier, a simple 5-minute hearing testing called as audiometry has to be done which will confirm whether you are suffering from age-related hearing loss or senile deafness. If you are diagnosed having significant hearing loss, then you are recommended digital hearing aids which has to be worn. They not only help you to hear and overcome your hearing handicap, but they also prevent you of bigger troubles such as Alzheimer's and dementia in future. Thanks for watching. I hope this video is informative and for more such videos, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.